Okay, in this video we're going to start proving some identities, and hopefully none of these will be too terribly difficult. Again, they're just review problems, but definitely I picked these out, a lot of them, just to remind you of some basic identities that you need to remember for sure. So let's start with 72 here. We've got sine of pi minus x equals sine x. So one identity you'll definitely want to remember is if you have sine of a minus b, that gives you sine of a times cosine of b minus cosine of a times sine of b. And likewise, if instead of having a minus sign, you have a plus sign, well, you would just get a plus sign in there as well. Okay, so if we apply this identity to sine of pi minus x, we'll just get sine of pi times cosine of x minus, then we'll have cosine of pi times sine x. And recall, well, sine of pi, uh, in terms of the unit circle, sine of pi is going to give us 0. Cosine of pi is going to give us negative 1. So all we'll be left with is well, we've got 0 for the first term. We'll have uh, minus negative 1, which is going to give us positive 1, times sine x. And that's what we wanted to show was correct. Okay, so definitely a useful identity um, in calculus. I would say you, for sure, that should be one that you know. You'll see it crop up, I think, often enough to where you want to remember it. So next we've got cosine of pi over 2 minus x. Well, the identity for cosine, if we have cosine of a minus b, for this one we have cosine of a times cosine of b. And even though we have a negative at the beginning, the sign now becomes positive. And then we have sine a and sine b. So likewise, if you started off with a plus sign in between your a and a b, you would end up with a minus sign on the right side. All right, so let's see here. Um, if we apply this to cosine of pi over 2 minus x, well, we'll get cosine of the first term. We'll get cosine of the second term, which is going to be x. And again, we said the switch is now, since we started with a minus, it becomes a positive. And then we have sine of pi over 2 multiplied by sine of x. Well, again, cosine of pi over 2, that's going to put us at the top of the circle. Um, cosine of pi over 2 is going to be 0. So we have 0 multiplied by cosine x plus, well, sine of pi over 2 is just 1 multiplied by sine x. And again, we get the desired result. We get sine x, which is what we wanted to uh, show occurs. All right, let's do, I don't know, let's do 74 and 75 as well. They shouldn't be too bad. I think 74 should be super simple. If not, you definitely need to look at your trig, uh, basic trig relationships. So we've got sine of theta. Well, tangent is sine over cosine. Cotangent is going to be cosine over sine. Well, if you cancel out the sine factors, hey, you're simply left with cosine of theta just like you wanted. So again, nothing too crazy. 75, we have sine plus cosine squared. We want to show that equals 1 plus sine 2x. Well, we can expand the left side. We've got so, uh, sine plus cosine. We'll multiply that by sine plus cosine. So if we distribute, we'll have sine times sine, which is going to be sine squared. We'll get a sine x times cosine x. I'm going to write that as cosine times sine. And then on the inside, again, we're going to get another cosine multiplied by sine. And then we have cosine times cosine, which is going to give us cosine squared of x. So recall the identity that sine squared plus cosine squared. Sine squared plus cosine squared, that just equals 1. So write sine squared plus cosine squared 
equals 1. If you only know one trig identity, I would say that's the one to know. And then we're going to have plus um, 2 cosine x times sine x. And yet again, another identity that you want to know. 2 cosine x uh, times sine x, or equivalently 2 sine x times uh, cosine x. You can simply write that as sine of 2x. So another important identity. So 2 sine x cosine x, that equals sine of 2x. All right, and again, we've justified the identity, and that's all there is to it. So again, just some basic identities I want to refresh you on. I'll do 76, 77, and 78 in the next video.